everyone, welcome back to Comic Book Issues. I'm your host, The Last Angry Geek. And it's time for a very special Loot Crate unboxing. It's the June 2017 Loot Gaming Box. Now, I don't normally get Loot Gaming, but there's some Fallout stuff in here. and That's my jam, dog. People still say that, right? Anyway, uh, they are there's like two Fallout things in here, and I love that franchise, so I decided to get this box. Uh, think of this as a prequel to the upcoming bi-monthly Loot Crate Fallout box they're going to be doing. Because I am definitely going to be getting that. Uh, so let's just... And here we go. Open this up. There's also Brutal Legend, I think. Battletoads in here. I forget what the theme is. But the first thing is, and this is... They spoiled this. I knew there was going to... This is what the main thing was. Is there is a Fallout 4 replica weapon in here. The AER-9 laser rifle. Open this up. Yeah, I can open this up. And this is a scale model, obviously. It's not a real working laser rifle, but this is really cool. Let's show that there. That's one of the uh, many, many weapons you can get in Fallout 4 because war never changes. They still use guns and still kill people. We have here is a Brutal Legend t-shirt. I've played a lot of Tim Schafer games. I haven't played Brutal Legend. I've played Psychonauts. I've played uh, Broken Age. I need to I need to play Brutal Legend, but I'm not really a hard, heavy rock and roll guy. But this is a nice kind of uh, uh, black light kind of shirt. So that's cool. We have uh, League of Legends. Number five, Kha'Zix. I don't play League of Legends, so I have no idea who this character is. We gotta open that up again. Let's see what this is. I thought they might be sending me a Brutal Legend. They said there'd be a figure in the box. I thought it was gonna be a Brutal Legend figure, but I guess it's League of Legends. That's what happens when you have two Legends figures. And he's all wrapped up. There's an authenticity card, a card of authenticity that tells you that this is a real thing you're holding and you're not making it up in your head. So this is cool. This is a cool little figure. If you like League of Legends, like I said, I don't really know anything about it, but I can't deny that's a cool figure. So put him there. The last thing they said there's going to be like a Nuka Cola thing in here. There we go. It is a bottle cap. This is, oh, this is the pin, or what have you. It is, uh, Champion is the theme of the box, and it is a Nuka-Cola pin. It's a bottle cap pin. I got one of these in a different box, maybe Geek Fuel a while back. It was a magnet. But this is white. The other one was red. So I've got two bottle caps now, so if society falls, I'm already well on my way to having some actual change to spend. Battle Toads from Rare. God, I remember Rare back in the day. Good lord, this thing is... Oh, it's a belt buckle! <laughs> this is pretty intense. This is Battle Toads, kind of a gold-plated belt buckle. Who doesn't want people staring at your navel? I can't get the camera down that far, but you, you, know, where, you know where a belt buckle goes. So... The big winner in this box, I think, is the figurine is very nice, and of course, the reason I got it was the replica gun from Fallout. Also got the Nuka-Cola thing. I'm not sure what that is, actually. There's a poster in here. I think this is a Fallout poster, too. Yeah, it's that infamous kind of picture of the Fallout garage. And everything is on the back. You got There could have been any number of League of Legends figures. And it is a button, a bottle cap button. There were one of four. The red one, which I already have as a magnet. This is the white one. There was one with the uh, Nuka girl from the theme park. Nuka World. And there's one with a red rocket gasoline cap. That's cool. So, there we go. This was the June 2017... Loot Crate Gaming Box. 
champions. Uh, this is not something I normally get. Like I said, I did it for the Fallout stuff, and it's pretty cool Fallout stuff. The figurine was cool. The shirt was nice. It's a, it's a decent box, considering uh, everything, but uh, the gaming stuff is not really my thing, but I will be getting the Fallout box when that starts coming out, so consider this a prequel warm-up for that one. Anyway, thank you for joining me. This has been Comic Book Issues, and I'm your host, The Last Angry Geek.